आनी कहीं को पालक चालू आसा एम्बोयर जासिंत वाज सी आलवरीज सोजा फेरव हाँ काम पालक चालू आसा Boyer was the only goan to receive Sangeet Natak Academy award. He was honored with Padma Shri in 2005. He was also presented with distinguished services by then president of India Gyani Jal Singh. We will never forget you for your indigenous contribution to the people of Goa in all the ways. A reporter in Raya Ramesh Naik Raut. Indian nationals moving abroad to pursue their profession are majorly duped by agents. The Goa NRI Commission has brought this fact to light through a survey that says 52% of money is being curbed by the agents. Goa is the second state to conduct such survey on foreign immigration. Kerala is the first state to conduct such survey. This is the only the second state in the country to have done such a migration study. The first was Kerala, second is Goa. No other state has done it. nor has been such a study at the national level up to now so this is quite a, quite a good thing nri commissioner eduard falero alleged that the agents are duping the immigrants on large scale he also said that police are not taking tough stand on this issue what the study says for instance i'll just give you some points yeah. number 1 more than half of the money spent by the immigrant when he wants to go abroad to be precise 52% on an average is money paid to the recruiting agents now uh, there are a lot of recruiting agents which are genuine and honest but there are several of them which uh, really um, cheat the um, the the people who go there looking for a job and therefore about 20 cases i myself uh, had said uh, say, uh, had mentioned 14 cases 2 years ago uh, about 20 cases now are pending in different police stations against persons uh, recruiting agents registered or not registered who have duped people by taking money from them not giving jobs there is a move all over the gulf country all over the world actually as you have found out even in australia now that uh, against outsiders or well, that, that that's moving again. in goa itself i bought other countries against outsiders so there so there will be resistance to immigration with an eye to people coming from other countries inside your own country whether it is uh, in the gulf or anywhere else therefore it is good and very much possible for people to find jobs here itself lot of opportunities opportunities will only increase as far as goa and india is concerned a reporter devidas kamli with video journalist ganesh hotkar for prudent media Time for a short break. After the break, both students getting ready for school. Stay with us. Welcome back. New academic year commenced from June sixth, and students, along with their parents, are gearing up for school days. But like last year, this year too, they are not drawing a good experience. Lot of textbooks have not arrived in the market. Our series mission admission highlights the plight of students. Primary and higher secondary schools are commencing from 8 June. Students are all set for the new academic year but the new textbooks have not yet arrived in the market. Standard 9th, Hindi, History, Science, Marathi, Portuguese and French not available in market. Standard 10th, History and Hindi not available in the market. Standard 11th, Biology not available in the market. And Standard 12th Biology, Maths Paper 1, Chemistry and Physics are not available in the market. With just six days left for the school, students along with their parents are seen flocking to the bookstalls to buy new texts and notebooks. But they are returning empty-handed and depressed as most of the textbooks are still out of stock. One of the leading bookstall owner. Subhash Singhbal shed some light on the current position on the availability of textbooks in the market. Unu pustaka ma che late aile ham, puna ata hi ata ya kalcha vikakchan ya tab. Eleven, twelve standard ki bahut ek sagam pustaka aile ham. Tenth aji poru to stock achlo. Pakta ninth aji thodi do tinjar item yo baja. Tya ya falam parvane thale. Eleven, twelve ni eleven, twelve gira gaile. Purun baaki ya lokang dista gire. अच्छा ये जो समझ जो परे एट सुधा फ्री दिता 
या प्रमाण नाइन्था टेन्था ची हिंदी लोग लास्ट टाइम स्कूल सुरू जाए मुसर रहा मैं एकदम घता ऑफकोर्स टेन्था की बुक घोकानी को बड़े स्टूडंट आ ट्यूशन क्लासीस बी वा पा तीन Students are all set for the academic year, but most of the textbooks are yet to come. Student community is getting a feeling that education department is least bothered about this matter. A reporter, Laukik Shilkar, with video journalist Sunny Narvekar for Proven Media. International cardiologist of Victor Polo, Dr. Uday Kanurkar, briefed on coil embolization treatment to a patient of agnem lipoma without any surgery. Dr. Kanurkar successfully operated a patient of renal agnem lipoma or the vascular bleeding through a coil embolization. The operation lasted for maximum half an hour. Dr. Kanurkar, through a presentation, explained how to close the open blood vessels through coil embolization and treat a patient of renal angiom lipoma. Angioplasty is better than that. It blocks the blood vessels. This is exactly opposite. The blood vessels are blocked. There are certain conditions where the blood vessels are blocked. There are certain conditions where the blood vessels are open. And these are abnormal blood vessels. These abnormal blood vessels, they give rise to bleeding. And these blood vessels are closed by using these coils. Dr. Khanulkar gave a recent example of a successful coil embolization surgery conducted on an individual in Victor Apollo Hospital. Now in this one particular case where we have done the coil embolism, this fellow is a 21 year old boy who has got what we call as angiolipoma. Angiolipomas are tumors which develop in our body and the incidence is 1 in 1 lakh population. These tumors are not like cancer. Here the tumor has got is rich in blood vessels and these blood vessels <coughs> They suddenly rupture and give rise to bleeding. That's why it is called angiolipoma. When they grow big, they rupture and they bleed. And that bleeding becomes life-threatening. Patient can lose life. And why do they bleed? They bleed because the wall of these blood vessels are very weak. They are not well formed. And even a small, small, if somebody hits like this, it starts bleeding and it could be life-threatening. If about few years ago, he had to undergo a treatment, he would have to undergo a high risk operation where you have to take out the entire kidney, the good